and inside this lecture we are going to learn how you can select the exact value from the form for example inside our last class we have learned how you can select the form how you can just select the label the button the input tag again the button just in one place input and button in one place also we have just discussed about the type and for so what if you want just to going to select if you want to select just this one type is equal to text this one so i'm just going to tell you about this so here you can just open this two bracket and you can just say here type is equal to text just go and select and this one just it is just more uh, specified you can see we are, you are going to target just this one the first one the type is equal to text and it's here type is equal to text here I'm just going to say the border for this can be two pixel solid and just a green border. Let's save and refresh. Now you can see we have a green border around the first one. The type is equal to text. Like this, you can just target the second one. Type is equal to email. And let's just increase to three pixel of green border refresh now we have selected this one the type is equal to email because we have here the type is equal to email and if you just write type is equal to submit you can control copy this and paste here control v and save now we have just applied on this one three pixel solid green border around this button because the type of this button is submit and we have just selected this here so you can just select the form also just like this you can say action just like this instead of just writing form you can just select this just like this uh, here you can just write action and save now come here and refresh now you can see we have just a uh, border green border around this form so this just all thing is very important you need to learn you can just write here form i'm just going to cut this and you can just write here form and save this is the first way and instead of writing form you can call action also that you have inside your form action save and refresh so you can see there is no changes so in our last class we have learned how we can select the attribute from the form like type and for so inside this class we have learned how we can select the exact value for example type is equal to email or type is equal to submit or type is equal to text so i hope it is clear for you and you are understand and the most important thing you have enjoyed from watching this video so once again like always i know it is just repeated uh please watch the video do practice have a nice time and see you